Hi guys, just going to talk a little bit about the menu on the Brewler machine and the button layout. So on the right hand side you have your stop button. This will cease all functions no matter what the machine is doing. This time we have our mode button. You need to hold down for three seconds. This will bring up our H heading which is hardness. So the higher the number, the harder the product will become. The lower the number, the softer the product will come out. So normally we recommend on all Brulins start off at about four in your hardness depending on what sort of mix you have. Our next selection is our level lock. When L is 001, when the machine has reached a low level of mix, the machine will lock out and switch itself off until it's refilled with mix, turned on and off again. But if level lock is on zero, the machine will simply just carry on asking for mix and indicating the beeping sound, meaning it needs mix added. It's more of a safety feature due to each customer. We also have our P setting, our pre-cooling setting. So four degrees, five degrees, this is the overnight standby temperature of the hopper and the barrel. So we normally recommend setting it on three degrees, just below four, same as the refrigerator would keep it. And that's all the settings the customers, you guys need to worry about. We also have our storage mode button, which is before you leave at night when you're in production, you press stop and put the machine into storage. This will keep it in pre-cooling mode. And when you come back in the morning, you press stop, bleed half a litre of mix out, put it back in the top for the gravity fed machines and press production again. We also have our wash button, which just simply turns our beaters inside during washing procedure. On the far left, we have our production button. We all know what that is. That's when the machine's been primed, filled with mix and we're ready to go for the day, hit production and you'll see the count in percentage start counting up until the machine hits the desired temperature and it comes up fine, ready to use. On the right hand side, we also have our agitator button. This turns our internal agitator in the hopper and we also have our counter reset, which will reset the count, the total count of the machine during the end of each business day so the owners can see exactly how many serves they've done throughout the day. That's about it guys, very simple menu, easy to use.